Oh, uh oh, the left is in trouble now, cause now you got those from the hip hop community saying free Trump, son of Suge Knight, is now made a post says a free mind nigga Trump. And the left is silent now. And if you go look at the post, underneath the post, the blacks are saying Donald Trump wasn't racist until he ran for office. Boom, I've been saying this the whole freaking time. I'm glad some of y'all starting to wake up. If you want to find a racist, his name is Joseph Biden. Donald Trump has been uh, hanging around all people, black, white, Latina, don't make no difference. I don't understand why Jennifer Hudson ain't came out with more support since he actually put you up after you had that little situation. But now, those in the hip-hop community got him with a black face on now. He got street cred now. <laughs> Y'all ain't with and tried to arrest Donald Trump he says, free my nigga Trump. Oh, this ain't going to sit too well with the liberals now. Y'all going to address this or not? Because he's saying this, and if you look at the comments, the blacks and the hip hop is saying MAGA 2024. One fella says, you heard him. He said, free that nigga Trump. <laughs> you... This is, this is going to start driving the left crazy. Now y'all done went and gave him street cred. Oh, yeah, Donald Trump, he's on the yard now playing basketball. We playing basketball. We love that basketball. To the bridge. Oh, I don't know what they're going to do with this one right here now. They said this is a fake image. It's AI generated. Do you really think we don't know that is a fake image? It's obvious Donald Trump is not black, fool. I mean, it's obvious. You missing the, the point, though. The point, what he's trying to say, if I can get off in his mind now, I believe he's trying to say that you treating Donald Trump like you eat, used to treat the blacks back in the day. I believe that's what he's saying. He said he want him free right now. And all the comments is saying, you heard him. They're saying stuff like, let's go, Brandon. Do, 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 do. Let's go, Brandon. Said, free my guy. Big Trump, let's go, Brandon. Is what one person said. Free my nigga Trump, man. Trump wasn't a racist until he ran for office. <laughs> You can't make this stuff up. The left has to be going crazy now. <laughs> this is insane. Oh, of course you're going to have some going to have a problem with it. It was obvious where he was going with this. But he was saying all of these crimes that the Joe Bidens and everybody else has committed, y'all not doing anything to him. What they're trying to say, they're doing a reverse on them. They're trying to say if y'all treat Donald Trump like he's black, huh? That's what I guess is what he's trying to say. He said Joe Biden, who's the real racist, I mean, he's white as Wonder Bread. He said y'all ain't doing His son is smoking crack and y'all ain't doing nothing to him. He said, I want Trump free, 2024. All y'all strategies not work. You should have just left him alone. What you're doing, actually, is you're making people jump on the bandwagon. Ooh, you know they don't like this right here. Said free big Trump, somebody said. <laughs> oh, somebody said, I'd rather have him as president than Joe Biden. Wake up then. Yes, wake up, little children. It's time for y'all to wake up now. Mm-hmm. Uh, one person says, the lack of truth in political knowledge and facts uh, is is just mind boggling. <laughs> Some people have said, "Oh, dare him put a black face on Donald Trump." Do you understand these damn liberals have been 
putting it on blackface, making fun of you fools. These are the ones who want you on the back of the bus. The Joe Biden's the one who wants you on the back of the bus. And don't forget that Kamala Harris sold you out. Now, let's not forget that Barack Obama, quote, the queer messiah, let's not forget he's the one who chose this piece of trash named Joe Biden. Barack Hussein Obama with the fake birth certificate, with his fake degree, pretending like he's a Harvard professor or something. Laughable. Freaking laughable. But now, whoo, this ain't going to set too well with him. They're going to be calling y'all all kind of Uncle Toms and Coons and stuff. Can't be doing that. <laughs> I'm just saying, why don't y'all let the facts out? Maybe he's saying, why don't we just let the facts out? Let's let the facts out about January the 6th what the FBI was doing, their involvement. Nancy Pelosi, we need to see her emails, her text messages. The Capitol Hill police, we need to see what they was doing. We need to, somebody to go in and, and dissect all this video information that you said we have to be walked through to go see it. Uh, we need to, you need to explain to us how did the FBI, all this time they were saying Russian collusion, Russian collusion, when they knew there was no Russian collusion. Just think about that. James Comey, Andrew McKay, Peter Straw. Andrew McKay's working at CNN. You mean to tell me that there was zero evidence, according to John Durham's report. He should have asked for somebody to be indicted. He's a fake, too. But you're telling me that there was zero evidence, according to FBI standards, they had no cause to even open up Russian collusion, which Hillary paid for, you know. She was deleting emails, ignored subpoenas, destroyed evidence. I'm sure she destroyed classified information, too. And they said it wasn't a big deal. Joe Biden had classified information since 1974. He had classified information in his garage. His son's on crack. They took bribes. We got evidence that they took a $5 million payment from Ukraine to people we at war with. Did you see Anthony Blinken went over there to China? Joe Biden has been getting paid by China for years. Nancy Pelosi, Mitch McConnell. Oh, it's Republicans and Democrats getting paid by China. But nobody goes to jail. Nobody have their house ran up into. Nobody's been dragged from court to court when they're leading in the polls. There ain't but one candidate that they're treating like this. So this fella says that give him his street cred. He said, free my nigga Trump now. Say so you don't know he don't like the way you treat him. He don't like the way you treat him, my nigga. He's just saying he don't like it. And so therefore he's saying free him. He's saying let the people choose. I don't want to hear nothing about no fake classified information now when Barack Obama and everybody else destroyed. They didn't give nothing over. When the people asked him to give it over, they did you a liar. They sent a subpoena and everything else to Hillary Clinton. She she took a hammer to her devices and everything else. Joe Biden hadn't gave up any information until they ran up in Joe Biden, until Donald Trump's house. Then they started talking about that. Mike Pence, too, another fraud. Judas, bet you'll sell Jesus out for 15 pieces of silver. Mike Pence, acting all, um, please, please come off the cross, Mike Pence. I'm, I'm tired of you trying to act like you're being crucified or something. They let you off even though you had classified information, and you weren't the president, by the way. Let's just don't forget that fact. You will never be President Mike Pence. And now, I just can't get over this. Saw this image right here. I said, what is this? I look like Trump. Oh, that is Trump. My nigga Trump. He said he want him free. He wants y'all to stop being biased and let all the information come out. See, this is, why I, what, this is what irritates me about the FBI and the CIA and everybody else. China was, and, 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 and Russia and everybody was hacking in Hillary's emails. It was classified information. I don't want to hear that. And you folks weren't concerned about that then. So what the FBI is trying to act like, they're trying to protect us from classified information. Child, please. Can't nothing about no classified information. So you've been exposed. Look at all the things that the FBI has done. Two or three years of them pretending like there was Russian collusion. Some of these fools still. And Adam Schiff, 20 Republicans side with Adam Schiff to protect him. Adam Schiff knew it wasn't no Russian collusion. What did he do? He still went along with it. Oh, but now, 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 uh, some of those in the hip-hop community says that we're seeing some injustice going on now. It's systemic racism against Donald Trump, if you ask me. 
You, you, you ain't never seen nobody get treated this badly by the media, intel community, ever. Look at his own party going against him because he won't bow down to them. Got him. Y'all I don't know what they're gonna do with this right here, but Trump is in prison. They say. They say. He say he want him free. He want him free now. They say we don't like the way you. We dare you put that up there. Just did it. Get over it. Get over yourself.